Hey everybody, it's C N She Her. Uh, we got we got something. We got a real treat for you today in the hole. It's it's Full Metal Alchemist Stray Rondo, or as it was originally known, Hagane no no Renkin Jutsushi Meso no Rondo. Um, so this, yeah, this is a Full Metal Alchemist game, and you might be thinking, well, it's in English, but it's still got Japanese. What is this crazy thing? Well, as you can see with that MZ there, this has been, this game has actually had a translation. It's a Japanese-only game with a translation, and it's done by MZ, so very much thank you to MZ. Um, I guess Full Metal Alchemist is actually popular enough, so it actually has a translation. <laughs> So, Full Metal Alchemist is a manga which ran from 2001 to 2010, and this game is based on the original anime that ran from 2003 to 2004. Um, both the original anime and the manga and Brotherhood, I'll, get, I'll explain Brotherhood in a second, are about two brothers who become alchemists for the state in an alternate universe Europe. And they quest for the Philosopher's Stone for purposes of reinstating their bodies as they were after they break one of the fundamental rules of alchemy. Uh, we like the original anime. We haven't seen it since we were a kid, though. I know it kind of has a mixed reputation. So what they did was, for the original anime, they knew they, knew they were going to run into, like, filler hell if they actually adapted the anime, so they got permission from the mangaka to create something whole cloth. And then once the manga was actually finished in 2010, a new anime, Brotherhood, released, which actually follows the manga's plot. Brotherhood is like one of the greatest works of long-form fiction media that we've experienced. And you can watch the two together because Brotherhood actually also fast-forwards what um, the original anime went over, so even if you're like, oh, I know all this stuff, it goes so by so fast it doesn't really matter. And yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited that this game has an actual translation. Let's get into it. Okay. Okay, so is this going to be like the... Yeah, this is the original incident. So yeah, they're they're trying to put Yeah, they're trying to bring their mother back with alchemy after she died. And you're not supposed to do that. Oh, Al's Al's so sad. <laughs> Al's gonna be very sad after this is done. So I'm pretty sure this game is an RPG. I don't know how much we'll play, but it's it's nice we can actually play an RPG in English for once. Or any Japanese exclusive game in English, honestly. Yeah, so that's that's the events that happen on October 12th. Someone's gonna be like, no, it's October 11th! I can't remember the exact numbers. That is the principle of alchemy. Yeah, equivalent exchange is a big, big thing in the series. The Philosopher's Stone, I believe, is supposed to get rid of that equivalent exchange, which is why everybody wants it. Rio. Also, this is... Oh, it's starting to actually let me advance. Everything up to this point is just advanced on its own. Yeah, so this is this is where the first arc of the anime takes place in this town. 
So I guess this is following the anime. I think... Rose is a very different character. You see, we've seen Brotherhood, like, last year, the year before we watched Brotherhood. But we haven't seen the original anime since we were, since we were like a teenager. We we enjoyed it, but it's it's a different beast altogether. So a lot of characters end up on very different arcs. <laughs> he just broke the radio. Here we go. Wow, what a surprise. An act of miracle. <laughs> I don't get it, but that's cool. Well, I'm going to church. Yeah, so the first arc is about this town, um, this desert town. The whole desert, I feel like the whole thing with the desert town and people was kind of run, ignored in the original anime, but they're, one of the main themes of uh, Full Metal Alchemist is, like, imperialism and anti-imperialism. I don't think the original anime really touches on that as much because it gets lost. But again, it didn't it didn't know. It was like, what, three years into the manga? It would have been filler hell if they had actually followed followed the manga. So ultimately we did get the better work that way, but eventually someone had to come along and make a better work <laughs> to actually adapt the thing. You watch, in like 10 years, they'll make a Game of Thrones that actually adapts the last book. <laughs> oh, they got that sprite. Oh yeah, Ed's uh, very short. They really got captured that, I think, though. He's notably shorter than other NPCs. And he hates being called short. That's the power of miracles. <laughs> Could it be? Oh boy, let's see the man. So do we have like a menu? Oh, we have a save. Okay, here's our menu. I like status is uh, Armstrong. <laughs> He's always so he's always buffing and flexing. Okay, can't go status. Oh, we have our silver watch, that's cool. It's in uh can't go to alchemy. Okay. Kitty. <laughs> no! <laughs> you must look after it. <laughs> yeah, Al keeps a bunch of cats inside his suit. Uh, I don't... I don't even think it's a spoiler, given it... So... The original... Both animes don't actually show you the flashback of how of how they lost their bodies until, like, a few episodes in. But since this started with it, um, I think it's kind of obvious Owl is not in his suit. He has... His soul is tied to the suit thanks to a marking inside of it, but the suit itself is empty, which often surprises people who are expecting that he's actually in there. Because of that, people also tend to think he's the full male alchemist, but he's not. 
it's actually Ed. And that, you know, causes some misunderstandings, but it means people are often looking for the wrong person. I'd like to see, like, a battle. It's... I'm troubled by this, by how you think I'm a fucking liar. <laughs> Yeah, so they're looking for the Philosopher's Stone, like I said. That that drives a lot of the early arcs. Later arcs go very different, but I won't I won't get into that. We need Act of Miracles. Headphones feel weird. Okay, I think I got them bomb feather. Okay, battle? Battle time, right? Yeah, battle time. Damn. Just kidding. Yeah, we, uh, we saw this in the opening, too. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here's a battle. Okay. Oh, it uses, like, ATB? Interesting. Oh, this is automatically happening. Okay, so you go to alchemy. Okay, so there's... So you have to make things to make... So you kind of have to do, like, mid-battle alchemy? This is, again, this is all just automatically happening. Tutorial stuff. But that gets you a weapon, right? No? Okay. Create a new material by picking at least one more. First one select is the base. Then you rise and lower the mass and value with others. Card's mass or value can't exceed seven. Card's level can only go up to five. So it's kind of like a card game, kind of like? Okay. Interesting. So now, no, I still can't play. Dang it, I wanna, I wanna actually play. I don't just want to watch the CPU play. It's canon. <laughs> that was fun. I wish I had done it. So that's, yeah, that's that's what I did. I think Rose was like a bigger character in the original anime than in Brotherhood, if I remember right. But I might be mixing it up. Okay, do I actually get to... No, he's running. Oh, I skipped a word. I, I don't know what that last word was. I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to skip through text. I have a metal 3-2 card. I want to use alchemy on a map. Select the needed cards from here. So, crystal? Is that the, that's the only 3-2 you have, right? Yeah, you don't have a metal 3-2. Okay.
Okay. I I want to do things. Stop just showing me. Let me play. Let me play. This use command. You can use alchemy on a map with it. use it wrong, you just lose it because we just made it so you could easily screw up. Okay. No! Let me play! Just scream until this game lets me play. I just want to do a battle. Oh, this has got to be a battle, right? <laughs> Guess I have no choice. Uh, purple materials? What if it was purple? Massive value go down. Why would I want that? That's scary. Okay. Okay. I get to actually play now, right? This is the point. Yes, I can actually play. Oh my god. I get to actually play the game. What am I gonna make, you guys? Um, let's mix chromium and water. Make whatever this is on the believer. Ah! Abby, 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 believer! This punishment. Oh, oh ho, oh, that was pretty neat. Oh, oh, so all this and Owl doesn't actually have alchemy, it just has skill. A collected cat's attack for Owl. Uh, let's just do the firing hammer, I guess? Okay, so he has to build up his ATB again to use that, okay. Dark matter. It's not. I don't really want dark matter. It's kind of. Okay, I'll move. Put these two together. Let's make whatever this is on that guy. I don't know. I forget who I selected with Al. Ed's big cannon. <laughs> Blowed him the hell up. Okay. Neato. And now we've got random battles. Okay. Uh, this game's... Already... I think this game's kind of interesting. Um... It's kind of... Oh, you gotta experiment a lot. That's very clear. But I think that's that's neat. They really um, made the alchemy such a part of this game, you know? Like, al like I'd hope they'd make the alchemy such a part of it, but I think that's a neat way to do it. I do think it's a little, it's a little maybe complicated? Fraught drunkenness. The hardest one. Okay, so let me mix these two. I think I'll at least beat Cornello in this vid. The thing with RPGs that's gonna be hard to rate is like RPGs are long, so like I can play this game. And then I, and I can be like, oh, this is pretty good, but it might be you play it for like, you know, 12 hours, and you're like, wow, this is actually pretty bad. <laughs> uh, can't use it. Okay. I 
Can I combine anything right now in my hand? I don't think I can. Let's just use Dark Matter. One of the things I don't get is why I'd want to use the wall from Owl instead of the uh, multi-hammer, because that seems to do more damage and takes the same amount of time to charge, but maybe I'm, maybe I'm seeing it wrong. I just need to get things done, huh? Just need to get things out of my hand. I guess I could see that as a pro as a very potential problem is just having to deal with your hand in general because it's just kind of random. But again, it's hard to tell in a short period of time like this. <laughs> Oh, I can mix, I can actually mix these. Okay, let's make this thing. What's that make? Low Spear, oh yeah. Spear him. Like there's also, like Ed's always make it spears, so it's great to see that. I wanna, I wanna do the cab attack. I wanna see what that looks like. <laughs> Oh, that's not much damage right now, I assume, because we only have the one cat. So I can... I can put three things together. What's this make? The Sky Strike. <laughs> Drop the weight on him. Love when anime just drops a weight on someone. So what's just a basic attack like? Pretty... Actually, that's not too bad. I could probably basic attack through here, but you know. They're playing an RPG in actually English for once on this channel. Your lies will soon spread all over the town. I think Cornello also actually had significance in Brotherhood, and he doesn't in the original anime. I don't remember that, though. I don't remember entirely. But these are some fucking jams. Okay, let's make this. Oh, that hits both of them, too. We won't definitely want to take out the Chimera first. Wind Guide. I, it just made the power of wind through my alchemy, I guess? Oh. Uh, why don't you heal, Ed? That's turn. You know what that does? I don't know what that does, though. So I'll use that. I'll use that on Cornello. The beast... The Chimera's already almost dead. Wink Kendo? Well, he stabbed him. <laughs> oh, he got... He, he alchemized the gun! Put that in too, and then I can make whatever this is. Space walls. Oh, that was that was really good. Status is just too different. I have to fight him again, or...? Okay. Doesn't seem like we have... we're getting leveling up for getting experience? I don't know. 
It's just a side effect, you dummy. It's... Now it's, you tell me it's a fake? You dummy. It's, and then they just leave him to die. Now I think he is significant in both versions, but I think he's a little... I think he's more significant in Brotherhood. And I don't know. It's, oh, I skipped past that. This is the problem. We're always pressing A to make the text go faster. Sometimes we skip past stuff by accident. <laughs> Save the charity so far. Yes, please. Yes, continue the journey so far. Oh, things are happening on the train now. The ball clan. <laughs> hostage, huh? I could lose a hostage or two. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it here. This is Oh We're in random battle territory. Uh, this is only, like, a taste of the game, because we're in the license game hole, you know? Um, this game seems alright. <laughs> From playing, like, what, 20, 25 minutes of it? I don't know how much time I spent- Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh. I don't know how much time I spent on intro. Um... So I don't know how much time I've actually spent on game, but this game seems alright. Our biggest problem with it is, like, the, again, it's the card system, but I think that's... I'm seeing it's easy to make a lot of the same things, and then once you start knowing what you're doing, I think there's more... You know. And it's never like you can't do anything, which I think is important. You can always do something, at least. But yeah, I think the random element to it might become a problem over time. Oh, nature level 225 for 800 cents. Oh, I need to get rid of a card, though. Um, I don't know what I want to get rid of. I guess I'll get rid of something, though, because I'm not playing this game much. M much more. Um, see, that says easy to produce, so I think we can get rid of lead pretty easily. Okay, I'll try. Now I can use it. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, this battle system seems interesting, but, you know, there's a lot of questions just because we haven't actually... We're only playing, like, a little tasty... The what? The what now? The buy question mark 3 Fufun? What the hell does that mean? Okay. I can't use anything else with this. Okay. It's an interesting system. I'm still not entirely... Yeah, I'm just not entirely sure how it works in the long run. Like, if you can easily, like, get into uh, bad spots with it, you know? Um, I'm gonna give this game a 4 for adaptation, but it's a strong 4. I'm seeing a lot of, like, love for the source material here, and, you know, all the alchemical things you can do are really neat. 
Uh, it's so scary. Uh, for fun, I'm gonna give this game a uh, three. And mostly that's just because I don't know... I don't know how this game would would be in the long term. Like, obviously it's fine here in this video, but... I just... I don't know how the alchemy system will work in the long term. I don't know if it starts to lose some of the appeal once, you know, you have more of your, um, more of your book filled in, and then it's like, oh, I already... I can just do, like, the good things with this, you know? And I just, I just, I just don't know, <laughs> is the thing. But yeah, this game seems pretty solid, and if you're a fan of Full Mal Alchemist and looking for an RPG to play, the, the translation is out there. Um, if you're looking for the translation, romhacking.net is your friend. I need Ted to get some heals. But yeah, I I would recommend I would likely recommend this if it looks fun to you. I don't know how good it's gonna be in the long term, but this seems like a pretty good time. I'm gonna defeat this macho and then call the video. Death Meteor Spur. Oh, it's the spear. Okay. I'm really glad these. There's another one of these that we'll see down the line too. I'm hoping that one is also pretty good. But yeah, once we beat these guys, I'm gonna call them a vid. I'm just, I'm just so happy to actually play one of these in English, honestly. <laughs> actually be able to know one of these. I guess, I guess Bobo Bo just isn't that popular. Bobo Bo and Shaman King. The Shaman King, I'm not surprised is popular. I didn't know Bobo Bo was such a, was more of a cult thing, you know? Punch him. Oh, I can do a combo. Oh, that's neat. But yeah. Thank you all for watching. That's gonna be it for now for Full Mail Alchemist Stray Rondo. Let me record our journey so far. Why not? Um, if this looks fun to you, go ahead and pick it up, why don't you? It's right here on your computer. But yeah, that's gonna be it for now. Uh, thank you all for watching. Oh, there's something not translated here, huh? <laughs> I think that's just their names again. But yeah. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you again later in the licensed game hall. Bye, everybody.